Welcome back, this is the Network Berg, and in this lecture we'll be going over Ramon. So Ramon is an overlay network that basically functions at layer two using Winbox so that we can connect and manage various different routers that's participating in this overlay network in Ramon. Ramon is very quick and easy to configure and once you've set it up on your network, you will see how easy it is to manage many different devices that spread across the network. So this is gonna be awesome. Let's get into it. I'm just going to switch the view now. Alrighty, here we're in EVNG and we've got three different CHRs that we're going to configure Ramon on for quick and easy router management. Now, we might not see much of a difference if I go into Winbox and I see all three routers here, so it's quick and easy still to configure them. But what if more routers were connected to these routers? So there was a router four that was actually connected to router one. Um, how would we manage that router? Because it wouldn't be on our neighbor's tab and maybe we don't have the IP, but we want a way to still manage that device. This is what we'll use Ramon for. So to connect to Ramon, you've got this connect to Ramon button, but you need to have Ramon enabled on all of the routers that you want to participate in this management network. So if I click here now, it's just going to fail, going to give me some red text. So let's go ahead and enable Ramon on all of the routers quickly. So I'll enable it on router one, two, and three. And let's just zoom in. And to get to Ramon, you're going to go to tools, and then Ramon is there. It's considered to be a tool. And to enable it, it's as quick as just clicking on this. That's it, Ramon's enabled. Uh, there's a few other things you can set here, like your ID, but if you leave this blank, it will automatically be generated. It's typically just the MAC address of the router and you get a secret. So I would strongly recommend filling in a secret because if you leave this blank and you connect to an upstream provider and they're also using Marketic, then they'd be able to connect to your devices using Ramon because everything would appear on this Ramon network. So please set a secret. I'm just going to make this one, two, three, four, five, six for the sake of convenience, but try and make it something stronger than that. And I'm going to apply that. So there's an ID, there's my secret, and I've enabled it. There's a few extra things that you can do with Ramon. You can go into your ports and then you can set which ports participate in Ramon and what their cost is. But we're not going to fiddle around with any of that. We'll leave it as all interfaces. And if you go to discovery, it will show you here which other routers are using Ramon. And for this to work, we first need to configure Ramon on the other devices. So let's just do that. And I'll do this through the CLI quickly for the other routers. So here's router two. So I'm going to go tool, Ramon, set enabled, yes, and secret, one, two, three, four, five, six, done. And I'll do the same on router three. So I'll go tool, Ramon, set enabled, yes, secret, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, and then what I want to do is, I just want to go back to Winbox, and if I look here with that discovery, setting we can already see there are devices that is running on ramon they are part of this overlay network all right let's disconnect from winbox and we're going to connect to ramon now so ramon you're going to select which device you want to connect to ramon with you can use mac address or ip and you'll connect to ramon and then you'll see it will switch to ramon agent running or which uh, ramon device you're connected to and below that, you'll see your neighbors has turned to Ramon neighbors. And this will have a list of all of the routers that's participating in Ramon. So if there were routers further down the line, you'd be able to select them here. And when you select them, you, you again need to fill in your details. So admin and whatever the password. In, and if you connect from here, you'll connect onto that router actually. So I connected to Ramon on router one, and then I filled in router three's details to connect to it. And now I'm connected to router three via Winbox. That's awesome. All right, so that is going to wrap up this section about Ramon. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next video. See ya.